What exactly is an idiom? An idiom is a phrase or expression that has a figurative or metaphorical meaning that is different from the literal meaning of the words used. Idioms are often specific to a particular language or culture and can be difficult for non-native speakers to understand. For example, the English idiom to break the ice means to overcome shyness or awkwardness in a social situation, but it does not literally involve breaking any ice. Other examples of idioms in English include a piece of cake, which means something is very easy, and let the cat out of the bag, which means to reveal a secret. Why use idioms? 1. To convey a specific meaning idioms often have a more specific meaning than the literal meaning of the words used and can be a more precise way of expressing a thought or idea. 2. To add color and personality to language idioms can make language more interesting and expressive. They often have a cultural or historical background and can be used to add personality to speech or writing. 3. To create a sense of familiarity and connection idioms are often used within a specific language or culture and using them can create a sense of familiarity and connection between people who share that language or culture. Four, to create a sense of humor. Idioms can be used to create humor, either through their figurative meaning or through the use of wordplay. Five, to make language more efficient. Idioms can be a more efficient way of expressing an idea than using a longer, more detailed description. They can help convey complex concepts in a succinct and easily understandable way. Differences between idioms, metaphors, expressions, and phrases. Idioms, metaphors, expressions, and phrases are all types of figurative language that convey a meaning beyond their literal interpretation, but they have some differences in their definitions and usage. One. Idioms. An idiom is a group of words that has a meaning different from the literal meanings of the individual words. Idioms are commonly used in everyday speech and are often specific to a particular language or culture. For example, kick the bucket means to die, but it does not involve any literal kicking of a bucket. Two. Metaphors. A metaphor is a figure of speech that compares to things that are not alike in order to describe one thing in terms of another. Unlike idioms, metaphors often involve the direct comparison of two things and may be more clearly linked to their literal meaning. For example, life is a journey is a metaphor that compares the experiences of life to the experiences of a journey. Three expressions. An expression is a phrase or group of words that have a specific meaning that is not necessarily related to the literal meanings of the words used. Expressions may include idioms and metaphors, but can also include other types of figurative language, such as similes or proverbs. For example, all ears is an expression that means to be attentive and listen closely. 4. Phrases. A phrase is a group of words that function as a single unit in a sentence, but do not convey a complete thought. Phrases may be used to create a specific effect, such as emphasizing a point or adding information to a sentence. Unlike idioms, metaphors, and expressions, phrases are not necessarily figurative or metaphorical in nature. For example, on the other hand is a phrase that is commonly used to introduce a contrasting idea. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. If you are interested in private classes then email me directly at goldtongueenglish at gmail.
Com. You can just pay as you go for each class at a time with no need for contracts.